There have been hospitals here in Grafton for more than 110 years. The Unity Medical Center was actually formed in 1971. Our current facility uh, encompasses both Unity Medical Center uh, as well as Grafton Family Clinic here in Grafton, and most recently Park River Family Clinic over in Park River. Unity Medical Center has been uh, growing and expanding within the confines of our old walls for several years. Uh, but as we've expanded the services and brought more of those services locally to our community, we really have needed to expand uh, the actual walls of Unity Medical Center to allow for that growth that we've been seeing and encouraging. Our new facility is 36,000 square feet of patient care space. The first level encompasses our new surgery center uh, with two oversized operating rooms, um, as well as a, a brand new physical rehabilitation uh, department consisting of physical therapy and occupational therapy, patient gym, uh, and also will, going forward, include a new emergency department on the first floor and rehabilitated old surgery space. Our second floor is an all-new inpatient unit consisting of 11 oversized private rooms. Uh, that'll be the bulk of our hospital care uh, for inpatients, both medical and uh, post-surgical. And the third floor uh, is both mechanical space, but more importantly, our new clinical education center for both nursing staff, our medical staff, uh, and potentially for uh, use in the community for educational programs as well. Our new surgical rooms are uh, incredibly, incredibly impressive. They are the biggest I've ever seen uh, and really as up to date on technology as they could possibly be. With the new space and those possibilities, we're expecting to add further orthopedic services, uh, potentially including knee replacements. We're already doing shoulder replacements here. We continue to have visiting specialists uh, in orthopedics, podiatry, BGYN, psychology, and uh, providing those services on site is a huge advantage to our patients as well. Patients want to stay close to home and have as much care done in their own community as possible. Patients feel better when they're able to be seen by their loved ones and their families can visit. So expanding services is not only convenient, but also I think therapeutic as well. We're very excited about the new rehab department. Um, they have been longing for more space uh, for a long time, especially in today's day and age with um, attempting to keep patients a little bit more distanced. Uh, it was very difficult to schedule as many patients as we would have liked before with um, the more recent uh, COVID restrictions. Uh, the new space is both more advanced as far as equipment available to them, but also is much more spread out. We have more activities going on and more patients being seen at the same time. Additionally, even though our radiology department is not moving, uh, we've been working for a long time to update our radiology services uh, to keep that equipment up to date and as technologically advanced as, as is feasible for us. We did recently add 3D mammogram. Uh, we have a full-time ultrasound tech during the week that is able to offer uh, ultrasound services, including echocardiograms and 3D ultrasound for, for obstetrics. Uh, so our, our technology in the radiology department is, is pretty impressive. and um, We can really accomplish a lot here locally. We were very cramped in our old space. It's, it's served us well, but it uh, definitely was reaching the end of its um, useful life. Uh, so to have more space, be able to be spread out, be able to offer more services to patients uh, is hugely satisfying. And the more you can do for them and the more you can do locally, uh, the more appreciative they are. And that always um, is very satisfying as well.